The Veterinary and Livestock Division is issuing a final appeal to farmers before instituting the impounding of animals under the 2005 Animal Act. The additional emphasis on securing stray animals comes after months of sensitization and deliberation with farmers on the long-standing issue of unsecured animals posing hazards to pedestrians and vehicular traffic on the road network. Chief Veterinary Officer Dr. Sharmin Melville-Edwin explains that whilst the sensitization efforts have been successful in the past, the stray and wandering cattle population remains a major issue. We understand the, um, the needs of our cattle farmers. We understand the challenges that they face, especially those who um, are not landowners. And we understand these challenges. Um, we understand the need also for food security and food sovereignty. And so... We have, been, we have been working with them, speaking with them, discussing strategies and solutions to eliminate, to alleviate the wandering cattle and stray cattle on our highways, which also pose a, a high risk and a, pose a hazard to motorists, pose a hazard to pedestrians. They're also a hazard to um, property owners as well. Several control measures have been implemented as part of the stakeholder sensitization campaign, including the tagging of animals in order to identify the animal's location and owner. As the next phase of the campaign continues, the chief veterinary officer urges cattle farmers to follow the guidelines established by the Act and secure their animals in order to avoid having their animals impounded. Cattle farmers who fail to subdue animals commit an offence and are liable on summary conviction to a fine of $5,000 or to imprisonment for two years or both. Cattle owners must take responsibility for their livestock. There has to be responsible ownership, especially in the absence of land um, ownership and um, um, barriers in terms of fencing and so on, corrals. There has to be responsible ownership. We must take ownership of our animals and have them restrained, have them tethered to protect our public and also to protect the animals. So the Ministry of Agriculture is making this, is imploring the farmers one last time, making that last appeal and serving that final notice. And in the absence of cooperation, we will, um, um, we will look at the laws available to us, legislation available, which indicates that it is an offence to have these animals wandering on the highway, posing a, a hazard to motorists and to the public. And these animals will be impounded. These animals will be impounded. We're giving, serving one final notice to our cattle farmers. While the Veterinary and Livestock Services Division's efforts to control stray livestock continue, public adherence to legislation enacted by the government of St. Lucia remains critical to preventing an increase in stray animals and maintaining security along the island's road network. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anicia Antoine reporting.